Hello, I'm Tiffany Barsotti of HealAndThrive.com. I'm a spiritual and medical counselor looking for the psycho-spiritual emotional root causes for things that may be in your underbelly, things that bug you, trigger you, and keep you stuck. So I am really excited to share with you this modality really called Family Triangles. I was taught by Dr. Paul Brenner, who's an MD, PhD, and psychosocial oncologist, this technique of being able to see our inner relationship to ourselves as it got birthed in our childhood. Family Triangles looks at how our needs were met and how our needs were not met. And how those things played out sets up both our values and our biases, and it sets up how it is that we will manage our stressors in the world. So the reality is, is that we parent the way we wish we were parented, and we parent the way we were actually parented when we're under stress. So depending on how mom and dad managed their stress is having a trickle-down effect on how it affects baby. So you as baby were affected about how mom dealt with things, how dad dealt with things. Were they there for you? Did they shut down under their own stress? Did they drink a lot in order to cope with their stress? We all have stress in our life, and this is not a technique about blaming parents at all. It's actually looking for harmony, and I have seen in my practice so many times this be such a healing tool for families. It's brought people back together where they really couldn't see eye to eye before. It's a beautiful technique with being able to meet your own needs because the reality is, is that we're not being parented anymore. So being able to let yourself off the hook, become free from how mom and dad did things, find your emancipation and make conscious free will choices for yourself, then you don't have to parent yourself in the same stress pattern of how mom and dad did. It's kind of like a punishment what we do for ourselves in that regard. And it is our habit, it's the default. And like anything else, it takes a little work in order to create a new habit. But first we have to have the awareness around it. If you have the willingness to have a conversation and then you can bring awareness to it, now that's when change can happen. And it's really quite a beautiful thing to also look at where your values got going, how your needs were met by your mom and dad, and then how it is that you feel disrespected because people may not have the same values as you. So it is very helpful to understand you in this process. If you feel that somebody has disrespected you, oftentimes it's because you have a value that was not seen, heard, met, or realized by another individual. And that feels like a huge assault. But one opportunity of being able to let people off the hook is being able to see that they really mean you no harm. For most people, good intention is really at the root. Even sometimes when they hurt you, there's still a good intention behind it. So being able to see that realistically and completely is very, very helpful. If you're interested in talking about family triangles or anything else, please use the link below and book a free 15-minute consult. I'm happy to talk about this. Thank you.